Hello. What San Francisco neighborhood has the highest per capita number of children? If you guessed the Tenderloin, you'd be right. And what San Francisco neighborhood has the highest number of deaths from fentanyl poisoning? If you guessed the Tenderloin, you'd be right again. Now imagine the children of the Tenderloin having to navigate sidewalks on their way to school. What would they find there? Rotting trash? Dangerous, dirty syringes? Intoxicated adults slumped up against doorways? Even the bodies of human beings who've died from fentanyl poisonings? This is the status quo, and this must stop. But the good news is, we can make it stop. We can fund long-term, comprehensive treatment programs and insist that drug users enroll in them before receiving additional public aid. We can insist that dealers who sell drugs that result in fentanyl deaths be charged with felonies. If we have the will, we can do this. We can make the Tenderloin and all of San Francisco be far more welcoming and safe for tourists, working class families, and especially for children, for our children. This is my dream for San Francisco and all of California. This is what I will fight for. My name is Cynthia Cravens. I'm a longtime San Francisco Democrat and a lifelong liberal, and I'm a candidate for California State Senate District 11. Please vote for me in the upcoming March 5th primary. We can do this together.